made out of graphite. Just like diamonds, graphite is a form of crystallized carbon and was originally mistaken to be lead due to its shiny silver color. Pencil lead is made out of a mixture of graphite and clay, a combination which, depending on the mixing ratio, can be adapted to cover a wide spectrum of uses. With a comprehensive range of 16 degrees, Stedtler has the right pencil whatever the application. The mixing ratio of the two raw materials varies for each degree. The higher the proportion of graphite, the softer and blacker the lead. The more clay used, the harder and lighter colored the strokes. It therefore follows that the superb quality of Stedtler leads begins with the choice of first-class raw materials and the closely controlled mixing process in which graphite, clay and water are mixed together and ground to form a granulate. This granulate is processed into cylindrical shaped blocks which are subsequently pressed through a die. The lead comes out as one long string and is then cut to size. The leads still have a high water content at this stage, which needs to be evaporated out with great care, so as not to cause any damage to the sensitive raw leads. Out of the drying chamber and into the kiln, the leads are fired at a high temperature, resulting in a complete fusion of the clay and graphite. The leads are subsequently impregnated in a hot wax bath to ensure that they later glide smoothly over paper without scratching, a characteristic typical of Stedtler pencils and a feature for which they are well known. Top quality goes hand in hand with high standards. Stedtler has always been aware of this and ensures that its high standards are upheld. At all times and without exception, from the quality of the raw materials right up to the finished product. The pencil manufacturing process begins with a series of grooves being cut into a wooden slab. After the application of a layer of glue, the pencil leads are placed into these grooves. A second grooved glued slab is then placed on top, forming a so-called sandwich. These are pressed, dried and cut to individual pencils on planing machines. This is when the color comes into it. Up to six coats of lacquer are applied to give the pencils the distinctive appearance. The imprint is added by means of foil stamping. A final dip in a lacquer bath gives the pencils the distinguishing dipped end, a typical brand characteristic. The pencils are dried on giant wheels, then sharpened, packed and shipped to destinations all over the world. All of a top quality standard of course. A series of meticulous, extensive controls, including numerous writing and sharpening tests and mechanical and chemical examinations, ensure that Stedtler pencils live up to Stedtler standards. Brand quality with tradition. One of Johann Sebastian Stedtler's ancestors, Friedrich Stedtler, had been active in the pencil-making trade long before the foundation of the company J.S. Stedtler in 1835. Indeed, first references to him in Nuremberg City Annals date back as far as 1662. There are many similarities between the way pencils used to be made back then and the way they are manufactured today. Although in those days it was, of course, more of a handicraft operation. From cutting the wooden strips, to gluing the leads, right up to adding the top piece of wood. Back then, every single pencil was a masterpiece of craftsmanship. Today, around 1.7 million pencils leave Stedler's manufacturing plants in Nuremberg and Neumarkt every single day to be shipped to destinations all over the world. Stedler's pencil range comprises pencils in up to 16 degrees in round, classic hexagonal or ergonomic triangular design. It has the right pencil, whatever the application, from the learner's pencil for children, right up the pencils for professional users. Pencils in Stedler brand quality. Perfection made in Germany.